fourth grade, just like you. And I also went to a school which had boys and girls. And we had the same kind of bench that you have. We had the same kind of chair that you have. So isn't it wonderful that I can share something with you? Yes. Right? Yes? Yes. yes. So you see a uh, table, uh, you know, put in rows and we were about 25 children in the class. And we had chairs like this. Now the problem was, instead of this kind of a chair, we had a little bench, you know. And yeah, a cool. But the only problem is that if there is a fat boy sitting next to you, and you have a thin girl sitting next to that fat boy, okay, what happens? There is no space. space. And that's what happened to me. You see, I was short. Okay. I was very thin, okay, and I had a fat boy, and his name was Raju, and he used to sit next to me on the bench. Now, whenever I sat on the bench, I would fall, you know, and I used to keep pushing. Now, in those days, that's when I went to school, you know, I had a very strict teacher. Mm, and she had, you know, glasses. And she would come inside the class and she would say, Now everybody stand up. And all of us would stand up. No, no, no. Afterwards. Okay. And we all had to stand up and say, Good morning, Miss. And she'd say, Good morning, sit down. And I'd say, Thank you, Miss. And we should sit Now this teacher was very strict and she also happened to be our math teacher. Now you can imagine, okay? So this fat teacher, who was also my uh, strict teacher, she always she had two rules. She said, "I want everybody inside the class before I came into the class." <laughs> so wherever we were, we used to rush back into the class, and then we can't leave the class before she left the class. Agreed. It was a deal. We agreed to it. And the third thing was especially after lunch. We, like you all have come back now, we had to get inside the class before the lunch period was over. So there was a little boy who used to go and ring the bell. You know, we had this big gong. Yeah. Like, you know, that was Yeah, yeah. And dang, <coughs> the sound used to go. So we had this boy who used to, so we used to look, watch out for the boy. The minute he's going to pick up at least to run back into the class. All of us was going to stand in our benches. Now, all of us love to go out for lunch, eat lunch and go out of the class because ours was the first school that had a cooler. You know, in those days, cold water, this was the school that had set up a cooler point. And we all used to love, and love to go and press that button there and drink that cold water. Oh wow, wonderful to feel that cold water. And sometimes the uniform used to get wet too. <laughs> and you know, it was wonderful. So all of us used to queue up to drink that cold water. Now it so happened that this math <coughs> teacher came into our class one day and she said, put on her glasses and she wrote on the board something. She said, uh, um, she said, I'm going to teach you. Fractions, fractions. Children, they are going to teach And she said, and she looked at both of us. In the meanwhile, what happened is, I was so angry with Raju that I told him that I was bitch. You know, I just I pinched him. And he said, ouch! You see, I was quite strong. <laughs> so he said, Ouch! And this lady who turned back and she said, Stand up. <laughs> hey, Raju, stand up. <laughs> and Raju stood up. Out! But she only pinched me. <laughs> she said, I don't want to hear anything. Out with your head. She took one big stick. Again, you are talking. 
said, out of my class. I don't want to see you. Out of my class. <laughs> I have this boy. <coughs> he went outside the class. Now that was the punishment in those days that we were asked to stand outside the class. Now the best part of it was that I had the whole bench to myself. Happy, I cut it into half, you get one by two, one by two, you understand? <laughs> I was wondering how you can take an apple. <laughs> because how big is an apple? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And she was showing us. classroom full speed and I was running full speed in the opposite direction. So you can imagine. And you know when we run we hardly see the person coming in the opposite direction. So there we then and both of us just collided into each other. How far are you? Yeah? How far are you? I'm going to go. See, I'm missing you. I'm just going to go. What happened to your teeth? I don't know if I lost it. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> and you know, I, I used to, uh, all of us used to like Raju because he had these two buck teeth in front. <laughs> like, you know, Bugs Bunny. Yeah, yeah I have it. Yeah. <laughs> the buck teeth, yeah. He wants some dance. Okay. So we have these two. And he and suddenly there was a no pain, you know, no front teeth at all. And he was doing all the air coming out. You know? And he asked I'm fine, what happened? I don't know where I lost my teeth, yeah. But you know, I think it'll grow again. You know? <laughs> and then he said, This is very fast. Yeah, yeah, I read all the books, it was very nice. I said, uh, you know the doctor gave me another present. present. There was a box, right? So I said, oh, I forgot to see that box. So I took that box and I opened the box. Yeah, there was something very nice inside the box. Guess what? Mm-hmm. 
tomorrow is never going to happen this way. Oh, all animals um, went and um, went along with us, and Camel had a suggestion to make. Let's go get the monkeys, Tim. Let's go get the monkeys, Tim and Tom. Okay. <laughs> uh, um, so, they, so they all went to the zoo. <laughs> uh, I saw the bird. I the bird. I heard my head. I had a little ligament tear. Oh. And then. <laughs> uh, my mom could put me chill. I, I cried and I like, got the little tear. My mom like screamed at me. The wine like jumped on the bed. Uh, went jumping on the bed. <laughs> <laughs> then, uh, then my father came and he also shouted. He told her, Are you crazy? Why did you jump on that bed? <laughs> then, uh, because I jumped high actually. Okay. Then, then uh, so I put the tail and then I watched the movie. Then I tripped over, I got hurt, was bleeding, <coughs> down my knee, always, my feet, and I ran to the nurse. And then when I came back, then I forgot about the homework. Then I went home. And then my mom said, Where is your math uh, homework? Oh! <laughs> 